Hello guys, it is me, TL1974, and welcome to this spooky review. Today we're reviewing All Engines Go Gordon and All Engines Go Bruno. Okay, as you all know, the last review I did on All Engines Go was on the Trackmaster Revel or motorized Trackmaster um, Thomas, Muddy Thomas from All Engines Go. And I haven't done an All Engines Go review ever since. But recently, Gordon and Bruno came out in my Walmart today, so I bought them, and I'm going to do a review on them. Let's get started. We're going to start with Gordon. All right, let's get this box open. This might take a moment. Get out of the box. Okay, it's almost out. Okay. Yep, there we go. Sorry about the camera. There we go. There. Let's set the packaging over there. This is going to have to be burned. Okay, here's Gordon. Gordon looks, surprisingly, really nice. His wheels look nice. Nice wheel bases, I guess. At least they gave him three wheels. His tender is kind of good. But, let's see review the face looks really nice. It looks kind of just like the show because I have watched All Engines Go, but I wouldn't recommend it. The whistle looks nice. At least they added detail. They even gave him cat some cab detail here. Too bad you can't look inside the cab. The splashers look nice. Including the dome. The boil looks nice too. And the wheels. Looks accurate. Name. There are the screws. His buffers look nice. Plus he has a front coupler. And he also, and the tender looks nice as well. As you see, he has a nice cold detail, including he has a nice um, lining, including on his boiler. And he has a number four. And the wheels look nice, including he has his name, Golden's Tender. So, would I recommend this? Okay, we'll talk about that in a minute. But he is a nice model. I'll give it a... A five, a four out of five. Reason I say that because I don't like. Actually, you know what? I change it five out of five because he is a really nice model. All right, let's get Bruno. The only so far rolling stock we have gotten from All Engines Go. Son of a. Okay, get some packaging off. Now let's open it. Okay, it's almost out. Almost out. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, he's out. Uh, sorry, Bruno. There. We got Bruno. Alright. So, what are my thoughts? Well, the one thing I noticed is that... It's a little bit inconvenient, considering is that he's an American-looking brake van, like, caboose. And these are meant to be, like, British locomotives. So, a little confused on that part, but I will say this. He does look accurate. I like the fact they added the little lamp near his face, because I have seen some episodes on YouTube with Bruno. The face looks really accurate. His wheelbase looks nice, and clearly I like they added the 43, the back end. They have really nice detail around him. Including the wheels look nice. There's his name. Brake Car Bruno. I don't know why they couldn't call him Caboose Bruno. No? And he faces this way, so if I hook him up to Gordon, he now is basically the only rolling stop we have for, for, uh, for um, so far for all engines go, br all engines go push along until at least we can get, like, the troublesome trucks, maybe? And possibly Annie and Clarabelle? Who knows? But, do I recommend these? Yes, I do. These are really nice models, and I do recommend them. And maybe I recommend also you go get the other All Engines Go if you're, like, into collecting it. But, let's say if you're not into it, I wouldn't really recommend these if you're not into All Engines Go. If you're just going to destroy them. But, I do recommend them if you are, like, a fan of All Engines Go. I'm technically not a fan of it. I prefer the Classic Series. 
and the CGI series. But I figure I could pick this up because my friend Henry Fam One Productions, go subscribe to him. He's my man. And thank you for being such a good friend, Henry Fan. He's been wanting to get this for a long time, so Henry Fan, they're in Walmart now, so you can go get them. And Bruno. I don't know if they're going to be available in your stores, but I hope they are. But anyway, that is my spooky review on All and Just Go Gordon. Yeah. This is the scariest thing. Yeah, the scariest thing. I do promise more content for Spooky October is coming out. Like, I am going to be making soon something in the mines from Narrow Gauge Horror of the Rails. Anyway, I'm going to get on to that. But right now, my mom's calling me for dinner, so I gotta go. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to watch, like, and subscribe, and click the bell icon so you never miss a video. And I will see you all next time. Come on, Bruno. It's spooky time. I'm Bruno. Ah!